Look at these little babies. Hello. Hello. Oh, you're cute. Oh, he's gone. Hi, mate. You done just born, haven't you? Yeah? Literally. No. They're a bit unsure, aren't they? Yeah. Probably weeks, well, a week old. Oh, He's hissing well him. Cute. No. I'm not even going to try to put my finger in there because he's hissing at me. There's another one in here. He's hissing at you? Yeah, he's hissing. He's like, get away from my brother. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are in... Kefalonia. Kefalonia in Greece, so come along. Coming up the other way now, you've got this, uh, as I said, you've got this little village vibe going on because it's not, they're all in different uh, sections. You've got like five, three to five uh, sections of uh, apartments. Oh up and down and then it's all spread out uh spread out through the whole of the park so yeah it looks a bit of like a, a village if you will and it doesn't look uh, like the usual hotel aesthetics yeah. welcome to bob and fred's blog it's self-explanatory we've got me and fred here yep hi guys and we're just gonna go explore and show you around the place uh, and that's pretty much it yeah yeah so first we're gonna go like to the bar and show you guys around oh. and stuff hello there uh we're in the park right now uh it's not that great of a park mm. we've just got we've got this little playhouse here a bit broken we got a couple of these still yep. don't know the names got a plain one and Jerry. we got a little slide and climbing, we've got a pole. We got a seesaw that's very broken, which Fred fell off all times. Yeah. Ugh. Oh, this is my favourite part. Right, we got little the umbrella spins with it. Yeah. And I'm sitting on it. Oh yeah. Uh here we got the swings. Yeah. Got a little climbing frame bit here. Got for seats, baby swings, and another little climbing thing. Got a nice tree. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the park. We're back again, but this time we're at the gym. Got a whole bunch of equipment. This, uh, you pull on this and it lifts you up. You use your own body weight as the uh, weight. And I'm pretty sure this, you sit down with your legs here and move your here, I'll give this a test. You do that, you sort of push your legs in. Like you're riding a bike, except there's no pedals. Uh, that is a bike with pedals. Right here, are the little spinny things. Still don't understand what they do, stretch you out or something. Got another one. And we got a spinny chair. Nyom. Got another bike, another one of them pedals. One of them things where you put your legs, push, all of that. Uh, what does this do? This. Oh, uh, okay, right. That's quite cool. Oh, my foot's a lot. Okay, right. And that is. I'm not even going to try to explain that. But now we'll see you at the bar. So, we both got a Coke. Uh, the bar's right here. Uh, it's right next to a pool, which is good. Look out the pool. Yeah. Apparently, they said, they said on the reviews that the Coke is not that good. So. That is nice. That is nice. Way more flavourful. It's less watered down. I'm honest. I'm used to watered down cokes on holidays. This is quite nice. Good holiday. Anyway, um, that's pretty much it. If we see anything else, we'll tell you. We might go to the water park and look at that for a bit. We're actually going to look for a shop because we still need one of them for like snacks and crisps. So yeah, we can rent a car if we want to. There's details. 
So we've just been to the shop and apparently they sell snacks and drinks so that's gonna be good and helpful for future. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, the water park. We'll go there now. So I guess I'll see you there. Right, here we've got five water slides. Little sharks. Shark boys. But I'll try and find a map for you. So uh, the fence is in the way, but here's a little map. We got a little twirly blue water slide. We got another little twirly blue water slide. We got a massive orange one. We got a yellow one, which you can barely see. And we got a blue one. What is the same? Is that a sixth one? No, that's just connected to that one. Okay. So there's five water slides in total. Uh, so not that many but still really good if you really want like a day out it costs 10 euros if you're not in the hotel to come to the water park for the day i don't recommend using the snack bar if you're going all inclusive because it costs money at the water park you may as well go to the other snack bar near mm, the, the pool. other pools like the baby pool of, yeah. like if you've got a ball i recommend uh, playing football there if you like football and um yeah it's right next to the park and there's tennis courts and there's also table tennis over there like near the gym so yeah can i also add it smells horrible i know we've oh, we, we it may sound like we're over exaggerating but you don't understand how bad it smells we're going up stairs <laughs> kind of roomy we have like a full like a lot of room but look at the hangers there's not that many but i recommend you bring your own oh, right. we have a mirror yeah, you've got something right. Whee. so we do have a, a kettle a little pink one it's a little small one that isn't it yeah. little, little baby one we've got some plastic cups so we have got plastic cups here if you need any if you want anything, anything for a brew and then we got some extra towels and stuff. We got a little small fridge. Also we've got water in there. A little oh, ice pack. Oh right, have you? Yeah. Fantastic. So we got a little safe. There's no key in this now. No, you have to pay a ten euro. Ten euros for a key. And because Debbie's putting on the clothes away at the moment. We got some wardrobe space and some shelving. There's an extra duvet up there, I don't know why you want that. Because so, in the winter months, like coming into spring and going into autumn, it does get quite chilly here. Oh, does it? It can do. We've got an extra light up there, for some reason. We've seen the bathroom already, so we're all good. you got a nice mirror. There you go. Plenty of charging facilities if you need any. Mm -hmm. And there. Yes. The decor in here is absolutely wonderful. Very Greek. The beds, by the way, are pretty good. Um, yeah. They're not soft and they're not firm. They're just in the middle and they're really. Uh, like a slight memory foam. Yeah, like a yeah. Bit memory foamy ish. It's set up there. And then they put a TV on the wall. I would say though, the TV's not working at the moment for some reason. Just like the aircon. Um, I've shown you outside. I'm showing you outside the aircon does not work even when the doors are shut. Um, but might be a good thing because then we don't get to smell the shit through the uh, the apartments. But uh, other than that, we've got kind of a sea view over there because that is the direction of the sea down there. But other than that, that's the that's the look from that way. Some guy doing his towels over the balcony. Lovely. You've got a sea view over that side as well. It's very quiet here. Got a little mini garden, I think, with shrubs and trees. There you go. Is it a floor? So that's a bit more of an insight to the apartment five. Five. Fred's already shown you upstairs. Let's go. 
So the wizard of Bob's here. It's not flying. <laughs> Why is he not flying? Get that. Where's your wand? Where's your wand, Fred? This is the Nimbus 2001 as well. So we're just walking down to uh, outside the back to the front now, aren't we? Back to front. No, this yeah, is back the one. To front. We're going back to front. Yeah, so is this? Oh, we we'll go. We we'll go through the reception this way, do we? Oh, we've already been this way. So is that the shot there where we've seen it before then? I think it were. I think that's where they're going on about. Plenty of like uh, chess boards if you wanted to play a bit of chest. <coughs> nice little pass. So yeah, it's the uh, main reception room. So we've been here before, but we're back here again. Let's see if what this uh, what the shop is selling. <coughs> It looks small. It looks small outside. Ooh, very Greek. Uh, no flashing lights in here, huh? Right, <coughs> oh, love. How much are you paying her to work in here? Hundred pounds. Oh yeah, got changing rooms in there as well. Everything. Cute, aren't they? So you've got all your, all your biscuits and snacks and stuff. Got some crisps. Toys. Oh yeah. No inflatables though, no. <laughs> Are you not? We've just been to the shop to get some essentials. Got to get some crisps and water and stuff. Um, how much were them crisps? Two, two. Oh, 3.50 each for a bag of crisps. Debbie will show you. Just some random local... Well, they do six, uh, six waters and they're three euros, is that correct? Yeah. Yeah, so... Which isn't too bad. But, I've got to say, the uh, shop's not well stocked, to be honest with you. Um, just spoke to a guy he's here for two weeks and it's costing him 15 euros to the next um, available... Do you say supermarket? Well, just anywhere that shops, yeah. yeah anywhere that shops. To your nearest town, so, each way. Yeah, it's quite expensive that in a, <laughs> uh, in a taxi if you're uh, for two weeks. Yeah, for two weeks. Oh, yeah, it's 30 euros a day if you're going in every day. So I think we will opt to have a look to see if there's any cheap car hire over it, just to get off this uh, this bit of um, location that we are at. Off for tea now, I'm just going to see what the uh, food's like for tea. Yeah. Uh, See what's on the menu tonight, eh? Mm. You never know, they might have a themed themed night, they usually do when you go on holiday, don't they? Mm, sometimes. We will find oh, out. Yeah. Nine times out of ten, I don't really like it anyway. Can you take <laughs> of me? I don't I don't I don't it is with some foods uh, abroad, I just can't stick to it to be honest with you. It's not the same as foods at home, is it really? Definitely not. So I usually tend to go on a diet really, it does me good. <laughs> but yeah, we'll uh We'll catch up when we get into the restaurant. So we just got into the restaurant, it is very busy. We thought it was all seven, it wasn't, it was seven o'clock. But yeah, it's absolutely jam packed in here. I'm just gonna wait until it dies down a bit. We've got soda though. You don't understand it, me, because you don't see a lot of these people during the day, and then you come to dinner or tea, and that's when you'll find how many people are actually in the, uh, in the hotel. Uh, what is that? So, Fred's going to live off uh, chips for the rest of the week, aren't you? Because there's no chicken nuggets. That ketchup looks a bit... Uh, looks a bit different, doesn't it? Does it taste alright? Yeah. Fair enough. And it's cold. Huh? And it's cold. As long as you like it, mate. <laughs> you trying that, Fred? Yeah, with my... Uh... Coca Cola, whatever, and, this, and it does not look like it's Coca Cola. There's lemonade. Oh, Debbie, come back with her food. What's yours like? I don't know. What's the uh, what's the selection like of the food? Salads are quite good, um, and then obviously chips, veggies. So everyone, everyone seems to be opting for these beef patties with cheese in them. Yeah, it's like um, it says meatball, but I think it's like a cheeseburger. It's got cheese in it. How is it, Bob? Well, first, it tastes weird. Although, the aftertaste is nice. Fantastic. I'm just looking at this woman's spaghetti bolognese on there. It's just, what is that sauce? I have no idea, but the tomato sauce looks really weird. It does, doesn't it? 
So I've opted for a bit of chicken uh, pasta and um, I've seen some guy get some uh, carrots and put some oil on. Olive oil, so yeah, I'm going to try that. Looks alright. I know that I have to be a bit of a negative new new when it comes to uh, all inclusive food, but I don't particularly like uh, all inclusive food. I think it's uh, it's just mediocre, isn't it, really? But Augusto here on the right here, he absolutely loves his food. He's had two plates, he's had two plates of full food, and now he's got two plates of desserts. Well done, Augusto. So, some people like it. I, I definitely don't like uh, That's custard. Try all inclusive food. Debbie's just got some desserts. It's really nice. Try that. It's custard. Yeah. That's that. Do you like that? Go and get some. I tell, I will tell you one thing though. Uh, in some places that we've been on holiday, they don't uh, serve coffee or tea, do they? Not at tea time. Not at tea time. And we have found here that the dinner time and tea time, you can get as many brews as you want, which is unusual. So this is the pool. See how it goes down quite deep there. Yeah, this is the pool at uh, night time, where it's nice and clear and uh, nobody's in it. So this must be the bar area over here, right? You guys want to get us a table? Should we get a table over there? I'll take Freddy back. Okie doke. So yeah, there's another pool here. Didn't really show you around the pool before, it's too, too full too many people. But yeah, so this must be where uh, the entertainment starts over here tonight. On Bob's review, what do you reckon about the uh, food in there? Like, all honesty. No out of ten. I don't, I don't like it at all. Like, the lunch was okay, but the, the dinner... Uh, I think... I mean, we got there at the right time because Gusto took all of it. Yeah, pretty like, busy yeah. in there though, wasn't it? Yeah. Gusto decided to eat all the, uh, all the food, didn't he? Yeah. But... Food quality wise, what do you reckon? Do you, do you reckon that uh, you're going to last a week on that or no? no I know I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I think I'm going to live on chicken skin and chips. And snacks. And snacks, snacks yeah. and crisps. Yeah. Yeah, I'm hoping there's pancakes in the morning. Yeah, so am I. Yeah. Because I can't deal with that sloppy bacon. Yeah. <laughs> and then no doubt they will have Augusto sausages on. <laughs> 17 stack of pancakes must be but we'll see yeah hopefully I mean all inclusive for me I enjoy the breakfast more better than the, than the, the dinner sorry the dinner and the tea I don't really uh, I don't really particularly like the all inclusive for dinner and tea it's a bit of hit and miss sometimes but the breakfast you know what you you know what you're dealing with eggs bacon sausage but Bacon's a bit iffy. But we'll see. Might be on pancakes in the morning. So we feel like we've gone from one extreme to another here. So if you haven't seen the last video, which was in Mallorca, it was very busy, uh, full of people, um, and everything was on your doorstep. Uh, where we are situated in Catalonia at the moment, which is very much down the south of the uh, of the island, um, it's, it's a bit more more quieter. Uh, once the pools are finished for uh, the day, for the kids, there's nothing much here to do for the kids wise, really. I don't think there's any entertainment on at the moment, uh, just as yet. But there's no sign of any entertainment either, is there really? So, uh, but yeah, so once the pools are uh, all been shut down, there's really nothing here to do for the kids. Uh, they've got like a little park over there, which you've seen on the video already, uh, when Bob, Bob took you around. But other than that, there's nothing out here, really, for, for, for us to go um, to have a walk around with. Um, but we're going to try, we're going to have a look around, see if there's any, uh, anything to do around here at this time of night, but I very much doubt it. <laughs> we just have to persevere pretty much non-existent here as well uh, we found that they haven't got really much uh, wide choice of uh, alcohol unless Very you like basic your, yeah unless you like your beers um, anything to do with cocktails is off the cards gin and tonic uh, gin and lemon that's probably as far as go if you like your whiskey it's fine um, but other than that um, the, it's very very limited uh, when it comes to the drinks as well um, so we're just on the old Lemon juice. Lemon Fanta. So yeah. apparently we are, if we go back over to the water park, um, there is entertainment on for the kids over there. So they announced at the uh, bar then. So we're just going to head over there and just see what the entertainment's like for the kids. But other than that, the uh, the park is pretty, uh, 
The park is pretty rammers with the kids. At least it's the only entertainment. I was going to say, at least there's something for them to do. So. So it's this bar over here. Yeah. Are these cutting through the tennis? I mean, if you uh, if you want want a bit of a gym, we're going to the gym. can't really see it on camera but the uh, the moon over the front there the orange the orange spot is the moon it's like shimmering on the on the shore here absolutely beautiful we'll see if we can capture it on video anyway it might come out in uh, 4k beautiful Today we're gonna go to uh, Luxury and we're just gonna wait for a taxi right now. It's called Peter, 101 Peter. Isn't that correct? <laughs> Luxury. So what we did yesterday, all we did, uh, the weather's a bit grim, uh, a bit cloudy. Uh, so we just stayed around the pool really and uh, went on the water slides yesterday. We, didn't, we couldn't really, really capture uh, anything on video, weren't allowed to really. So, But today we're gonna go on a bit of a mission and uh, see what's about in Luxury. That'd be back in the taxi, probably cross the ferry like we did when we came here, and uh, we'll have we'll have uh, a look over there. Agastelli's over there as well, so we'll probably hit them both. So yeah, we'll see you soon. 